has recorded a total of 4,161 cases to date and managed three epidemiological waves with a total of 58 COVID-19 related deaths. At present, we have noted a total of 3,977 recoveries. During the month of March, we note the steady decline in the number of cases, in the number of persons accessing care at the respiratory clinics, and the reduction in the number of admissions at the respiratory hospital. We applaud the public for their cooperation during the last few difficult months of managing this third and intense wave in country. The Ministry of Health is encouraged with the progress noted thus far in managing the third wave and with the rollout of the COVID-19 vaccine, is hopeful for quality of life improvements in relation to COVID-19 in the near future. We understand and acknowledge the level of frustration that the public has had to endure by the many protocols and lockdowns in the past year. These measures have been implemented in an effort to reduce the impact of the virus on our vulnerable population. As we reduce the cases and the risk, we have been reducing the strict measures in a controlled manner. At this point, we remind the public that although we note the flattening of this third wave, we still have over 100 active cases. We would like to alert the public that mass crowd activities and open socialization is not recommended nor approved at this time in our management of the pandemic. We continue to receive numerous reports of widespread socialization across the island. We are still at high risk at this point in time. The public health team is working to reduce the number of active cases to less than 50 to enable the safe opening of more activities. We ask the public to work with us and continue to be patient the premature social activity will lead to an upsurge of cases given the exponential transmission typical of this virus. As such, everyone is reminded to continue adhering to the infection prevention and control measures that are proven to reduce transmission of the COVID-19 virus and keep us safe. These include the following, to wash your hands often if soap and flowing water or use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer. Wear your mask, which covers your nose, mouth, and chin. Maintain physical distance from others and avoid crowded activities. Let us all work together to sustain the safe reopening of school in April and maintain the numerous gains that we have achieved thus far. The Ministry of Health will continue providing updates on the COVID-19 situation in St. Lucia as information becomes available.